Again, once the epoxy is put on the wall like this with our pressurized gun, uh, we're going to take a manual a static trowel, a mixer trowel, and we are going to spread our epoxy on our location, spreading it evenly. And we will then be placing the grid, grid strap into the base of this epoxy. The epoxy will squeeze through the grid strap like making a million rivets and we will then trowel that surface smooth. Our installer is so good he doesn't need gloves. <laughs> The strap is pushed down flat as we can get it, and then from the sides we trowel the epoxy over the sides, and then we will trowel the epoxy over the main grid strap so we have 100% coverage. This method has been revised and improved over 17 years of development. We now make it look very easy. This installation used to take 20 minutes when they first came out with this product. After the epoxy is spread, we're going to take a clear cellophane plastic material and lay it over the epoxy bed and we will then be trawling the air bubbles out of the epoxy. If there's any air bubbles left in the epoxy mix you will not have adhesion. This is a problem with the dark carbon fiber fabrics and also the solid dark carbon fiber plates. You can't see if you got the air bubbles out. Consequently, when there's failures, we often see that you can almost pull the strap off the wall by hand. With this process, we get the air bubbles out. We know we have 100% contact with the wall. And after 24 hours, the wall becomes part of this carbon fiber installation. Uh, the two become one. The carbon fiber cannot be removed. The carbon fiber resists the strength of the uh, hydrostatic pressure, which is about 10,000 pounds per square inch pushing on your wall and cracking it. This carbon fiber grid strap is the strongest on the market now, according to the ICC, 217,000 PSI. This is super overkill, but this wall will never move. This grid strap will be anchored to the floor and the ceiling, to the framing making a top to bottom solid anchor. With the clear cellophane membrane on top, we can see any air bubbles that are left and we can push them out at this point in time. After 24 hours, the cellophane can be removed and this grid strap can be painted with a primer or you can scuff it up and paint it. And once it's cured after 24 hours, you could also drill through it if you needed to. It won't hurt anything, and you can anchor shelving or uh, drywall over it. 